Hello and welcome to this spreadsheet developed by the NavalArc.com to calculate the equipment number for a ship. Equipment number is a number which is used to specify and select anchoring and mooring equipment for the vessel. This spreadsheet calculates that number and also recommends the minimum specifications of the anchoring and mooring equipment required for the vessel. The calculations and equipment selection are based on DNV rules for ships part 3, chapter 3 section 3. Let's take a tour of this Excel sheet and see how it calculates the equipment number. This is the formula for equipment number, and the user has to input certain properties of the vessel to calculate this number. The inputs required are in the inputs worksheet. The basic particulars of the vessel are required, like the displacement, the length on waterline, breadth, depth, and the summer load line draft. The next and the most critical inputs required are the heights and the areas of deck houses and superstructures. The decks above the main deck with width more than 25% of the entire width of the vessel are to be included in the calculations. Those superstructures and deck houses whose width is less than 25% of the breadth of the vessel need not be included. There is a list of all these possible items for which the inputs are required, say the forecastle deck and the deck houses. Bulwarks and hatch combings greater than 1.5 meter in height are also to be included. Apart from these if there are any other items, the user can add them in these cells marked as other. If there are no other items, the user can just leave them blank with the value 0. Once all the inputs have been specified, the equipment number is calculated in the outputs sheet. This is the output sheet in which all the heights and the effective heights are calculated, profile area is calculated and based on that, the final equipment number for the vessel is calculated. From this equipment number, the minimum specification of the equipments required is recommended by the spreadsheet in this particular table. The equipment letter, the number of stockless anchors, mass per anchor, the stud link chain cable specification, the tow line specification and the specifications of the mooring lines like the minimum number of mooring lines, the length of mooring lines and their minimum braking strength, all these are recommended by the spreadsheet. That was about the equipment number calculator spreadsheet. You can download it from the website thenavalarc.com. Thank you.